All right, guys, welcome back to Feed the Beast. Feed the Beast, baby. All right, quite a lot of things has changed. I haven't made a video in a while. Last week was a hectic week. So, I'm finally making another video. As you can see, a lot of things have changed. I did a little, build of, little bit of building in here. Made a, uh, a pretty basic tin farm. I saw Etho make a tin farm, so I thought I'd make my own little tin farm. But it's not running right now. Actually, I'll get that running for you guys. Um, I need some tin. Okay. Oh god, creeper. Creep, creep. Thank you. Alright. Make some... What? No, no. Oh, you can make buckets out of tin? Okay, cool. What am I doing? Completely forgot what I'm making. I'm making cells. I forgot how to do that. There we go, right? Yes, okay. About to say. And let's grab some... Whoa, bros. I had way more than that. Well, we'll just use this for demonstration. I wonder if it didn't save. No, it saved. Huh. wonder where all my stuff went, but... What I do is I drop some nether rack in here, and then I drop. Oh no! Drop empty cells in this one, and then nether rack starts piping through, goes over here, that goes under here, and that goes into there. But I'm, yeah, those are full, right? All right, it just needed some cells, so I'm gonna drop some more cells in there, but then that goes to a magma crucible melts that down into lava that lava goes here and then I have three separate pipes running that into here and then the liquid transposer moves the well first the liquid transposer turns this lava in its raw form and puts them into these empty cells and that goes over here down into the uh, industrial centrifuges and then when those centrifuge down you get well actually I'll just show you lava if I can squeezer what am I looking for Let's try centrifuge, maybe. But, alright, when you... Let's see if I can find one done. No. But you get, like, I think 40 tin, some pyrite, one wolf ram, or whatever, so... Um, and I think maybe it... No, titan... Nope. Well, it's a tin factory, and I get a little bit extra. And it's pretty great. But that's that but the main thing I wanted to focus on this episode is anything else mm, no. is I wanted to focus on building a tree automatic tree farm sapling not sapling of uh, rubbers rubber farm rubber farm rubber farms Let's eat some taters taters but what we got is you're gonna need an arboretum, a logger, and a tree tap. So what you're gonna want, what you wanna do is I haven't built this yet, so bear with me. So you're gonna wanna place the arboretum down, and then you're going to need an engine. And I'll probably end up hooking up a solar panel to this, but right now, 
I'm just doing a bat box. So, okay. Let me plug up my bat box. Let's just put that right here. That should be good, right? Let's move it in one more. You'll see why in a second. If you already, if you don't already know, I'm gonna power that up with this. And did I forget wires? Yes, I did. I'm gonna go grab some wires real quick. But I got a suggestion to make a automatic tree farm, automatic uh, whatever farm. But yeah, so actually, let's turn this down probably. I'll be right back. All right, we're back. I just wanted to check, make sure my mic volume was okay. Make sure you guys could hear me. But all right, we came for some wires. Let's use some golden wires. The, good, the golden days. The good days. All right, let's get back up there. Okay. So, you can power this however you want. I'm just deciding to use this this engine. And then a lever. Okay. And then with that, you're going to need some hummus. Oops, and then I will use my pocket crafting table thing. So what you need is you need some sand on top, some sand on the bottom, and then you add that appetite in the middle. And then you get some fertilizer. So we're going to make some of that fertilizer. Let's make one stack. That should be good. And I forgot to gather some dirt. So I'm going to gather some dirt, and I will be back. All right, got some dirt, and I went ahead and got some saplings too, because you're going to need saplings. All right, let's get back over here, and we are going to place the, actually first we need to make the hummus. So what you're going to want to do, let's see if I have enough room here, just that on the ground. I need that. Alright, so you're going to want to do that, and then you're going to want to circle this in dirt. And then you get hummus. And we'll get a couple stacks of that if we can. Alright, we'll just go with that for now. And you're going to want to put your hummus in here, and then it's going to start laying it out. Alright, so that's going to lay out, and then while that's laying, uh, laying itself out, we are going to set up the logger, we'll place that right next to it, okay, we'll go ahead and place another lever under it for power, and... Do this. Okay. And then I'm going to put the tree tap right here. And that also needs. Uh, I'm making this difficult for myself by using. <laughs> these uh, electric things. Oh wait, it's still running. Alright, I need to get power over to this. Let's run it this way. Okay, that solves our problems. Okay. So, we're going to put another some dirt thing here, not there. 
put a true tap on top. Switch that. And let's run a pipe. Not a pipe. That to it. And drop a lever down. Not a bat box. Come on, man. What you doing? What you doing? Alright. Alright, looks like it's completely done. Let's see how much we got left. Alright, so that took about a stack and a fourth, maybe. Okay, so what we are going to do now is plant the saplings in, I think. Put the saplings in, and I think... Alright, yep, it's going to start planting the saplings. I think I don't have enough. I only had, like, 36 or something like that. Okay, so those are planting. And I believe the sap, this tree tap, if you just place it there, if you place it in the way I placed it, what it will do is I believe it will put the resin, it'll put that into the logger. So when you pull it out the logger, you'll get the, uh, what's it called? You get the, oh my goodness, sapling, not saplings, the logs, and you also get the resin. I think the saplings come out of there too, I'm not sure. No, alright, the logs come out the side. Well we'll find out once these are once these grow. So actually that was quite a lot of saplings. Alright, so I'm gonna let some of these grow and I will get back to you guys, you great people. Alright, let me see if bone meal works. Nope, looks like you cannot use bone meal to speed up the growing. Oh there we go. Perfect timing. Let's see what happens. Alright, so it's getting cut down. Sweet, it's working. Why is that not getting cut down? That one block. So let's try... Oh, got another one. Sweet. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I'm gonna need a chest. Let's go over here. Cut down good faithful. Good old faithful over here. The old farm. Farmer Rooney. Let's cut that on down, get some wood. Okay, and make some, huh, gives you jungle wood, interesting. Alright, get a crafting table, I'm too lazy to go back, let's just drop that in, I'll probably upgrade these to iron chests or something sometime soon. Alright, let's get on over here, let's drop a chest right there for now I guess. And did I bring pipes? Yes, I did. I'm going to drop the pipes from here, I believe. Alright, we got saplings. So, I'm going to put the saplings back in here, actually. Let's see if that works. The saplings should go back in there. Alright, cool. So that's easy enough to make that resupply itself. So if you put the top. Let's see. If you put the, the sapling or the pipe on top and have it go there, it'll resupply itself with saplings. But I'm curious where the resin is. There we got the logs. I'm curious where the resin is going. this for now maybe there hasn't been resin I don't know maybe if we do this nope. so we got some wood hmm maybe we're just not getting sapling uh, resin So we basically got that down. I'm going to let this run for a little bit. 
and then I will get back with you guys. Okay, that was about five seconds later, and you see we can got some resin here. I guess there was just no resin. Right when right when I said I'll be get back with you guys, it's like oh resin. So all right. So we got that going here, and it keeps disappearing. So what I'm going to do is I brought one diamond pipe, and I'm going to do this. Uh, let's do that, maybe. No, let's not do that. Let's do this. And then this. Come on, give me a pipe. Give me, no, no, no. Actually, let's do this. Good old jetpack. Okay, do I have any resin? Yes, I do. No, stop. No! God dang it, man. I can't do it. I cannot do it. Alright, so red. We want saplings. White. We want resin. Then we want that resin to come over here to the gist. It's not beautiful, but it works. It's all I care for right now. And let's check out power. We're doing some we're doing pretty good on power. Alright, so let's watch this go down. Got any resin? Resin, resin. So this thing's pretty cool. Now I just have to find a way. Let's see, hummus. To where I can make it resupply itself. Hummus, or hummus, hummus, humus, whatever you want to call it. So, is there a way? Hmm. Dirt. Is there a way to make dirt? Plant ball. And then what can I use? Plant ball in the compost. So it looks like I'm just gonna stick with appetite, but maybe I'll make a a wheat farm and then I don't know, turn it into plant ball or something like that. I don't know. But for now, I guess we'll just manually resupply it with hummus, humus. Yeah, we'll just do that for now. Alright, I've let this thing run for a while. Added some more hummus. Let's see what we got. 15 sticky resin. A bunch of blocks. I also looked at the thing. You can actually make more rubber out of the wood, which I will probably end up doing. So, that was a successful build in my books. I just have to hook up a solar panel or something but yep yeah. sweetness let's add a little decoration to the area just for looks let's see what we got in there I think make it look nice and pretty add some flowers oh nice and beautiful isn't it I think it's nice and beautiful now let's just sit back and relax while we're holding a nice diamond. Oh god. Oh god, my hands, they're slipping. Oh no! Whoa! I'm falling! No, I'm just kidding, guys. So, that's how you make a twilight portal. So, this might... Crap. Um, am I dying? Nope. Alright, cool. I've never, ooh, sap. All right, I've never been here before, but it looks pretty scary. I'm pretty scared right now. No, I'm just kidding. But it looks interesting, and I wanted to get into it. But that was a little sneak preview of next episode. And God, dang it, man! Get in the portal. All right, no, no, oh, okay. But what you do is you dig a two by two. And then you add, make sure they're all water source blocks. Add flowers around the outside. 
and then you throw a diamond in lightning strikes down and you got yourself a twilight portal maybe we'll go exploring there next episode or something but as you can see it took quite a long time <laughs> this is all stuff that I did to try to get those flowers but let's check on this one more time making pretty good progress Oh, resin yeah baby but I will see you guys next episode make sure you comment rate and subscribe have any suggestions for episodes let me know because I'm running out I need to start doing some more mods and checking those other mods out but see you guys later